And you said that racism that uh, racism doesn't exist anymore. When did you? I, ne I she never did not said say that. that. You, oh, read a, you read an article. No. Nope. I said I was never a slave. And then the root okay. ha jumped into the front of the, what I said and said, Candace says racism doesn't exist because she was never a slave. That was fake oh. news. Racism does exist. Well, America is not a racist I hate country. The root too, so. Yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Guys, I'm going to be reacting to Candace Owen debunks pathetic representation myths. Guys, let's get straight into this. First of all, I would like to say there are some points with y'all that I do agree with. The whole cost of masculinity and me too. I agree with you. But, uh, you said that, uh, in a 2018 tweet that, uh, America should give black people reparations? Should or shouldn't? Shouldn't. Okay. Well, I actually didn't. I retweeted someone else I think you're talking about. DC Drano. No, you oh. said you're saying so, uh, what, you said on Twitter that, talking to so, me, right? Yeah. Okay. You said your sure. solution for yeah. it is that America should just, should just move forward. Yeah. But the UN actually said that the... Um, the We're not the United Nations. I'm, I'm just saying that they said that the U.S. owes us reparations, but... And, the, and you said that... When that, did I say the U.S. owes us reparations? No, I'm saying that they said that. You the never UN. said that. Oh, okay, gotcha, gotcha. Sorry, I wasn't following. So the United Nations said in 2018... No, 2016. 2016 that America owes us reparations. Okay. My question is, and you said that racism that uh, racism doesn't exist anymore. When did you? I, I, ne I she never did said not that. Say that. You oh, read a, you read an article. No. Nope. I said I was never a slave, and then the root okay. ha jumped into the front of the, what I said and said, "Candace says racism doesn't exist because she was never a slave." That was fake oh. news. Racism does exist. Well, America is not a racist I hate country. I root too. So. Yeah. So um, like, why don't you think we deserve reparations? I mean, you did get a check for a racist act back in the. Um, for, okay, so first off, these are two different points. I do not think that we deserve reparations for slavery. I was never a slave in this country, and I think that the idea, if, if, you, if you think that you're going to get more than $200 from the government, okay, this entire debate is just, it's a, it's, it's a joke, okay? It's never going to happen. Do you think that we're the only group, I'm just going to ask this question, that has had something awful happen to them in this country? To the Japanese get reparations for the internment camps? Yes, to the do. Irish, okay, all the Irish? Who's people. Irish in this room? Raise oh. your hand. Should they get, oh, that's a lot of Irish people. Should they get reparations for the Irish need not apply during the progressive era and all the terrible things that happened to them? Should, what about the Jewish people? Should they get reparations for the, for, for the Holocaust? Well, they did get reparations in Germany. No, they didn't. That's, no, that, they that, didn't. Is a, that is a myth, and that not is false. America. They did not get any, they didn't get any reparations in America. So oh. should, so, okay, but well here's my question. Do you understand how slippery the slope is when you start saying reparations? At the beginning of humanity, the slave trade used to be legal. It used to be legal. And do you want to know who got reparations? This is actually fascinating. I learned this from Larry Elder yesterday. In the UK, they decided to give reparations uh, because of the slave trade um, when they abolished it. Do you know who they gave reparations to? The slave owners. Because black people were their property legally. It was legal, right? So when they got rid of it, they gave them reparations. The point is, is that no matter where you go in history, someone was oppressed. You cannot look to correct history by thinking that you're gonna get a small check because every single person in this room would get a check. It's just a means for them to seize you emotionally and make you think that you deserve something and you're gonna get something. And if they actually factually did it, it would probably amount to $400 that you couldn't even spend it at a, at a club on a weekend. Just telling you. That's what Elizabeth Warren wants to talk about. Guys, do you think black deserve reparations? I think black went through a lot, but we won't lie that. It happened and we are past it. Like centuries have passed and I think we have moved forward. Like I, I am happy to see a lot of black people like building companies, like owning shares. Like see, it's amazing when you see black person out there doing stuff. Like you've seen them in movies and like doing crazy stuff. Someone like Candice Owen speaking out from the culture. Like it makes sense. I mean I honestly believe that we were oppressed, but it's done. Like when you watch movies like them talking about blacks slavery when we can't own a house when when you see a black person you just think of him as a thief like when you watch movies like that you you kind of understand where they're coming from you kind of understand the anger but like when where we are now we know that those stuff does not count anymore like it it happened but like it's there like we are here like the difference is clear. So I honestly believe that I love the fact that I kind of try to remind people that we are done with it. Like it happened, we're done. Like let's move forward. And I love that fact. And I love the fact that Kanye Owen and Charlie Skate are doing this for the black culture. Let me put my seeds as they're trying to like 
deny some certain facts, but like I think they're accepting it. I see it as acceptance. But guys, don't think about this. Like, share, subscribe to my channel. I will see you next time, guys. Bless.